What's up YouTube? Welcome to Codeway Lectures. So now guys, we are familiar with how we work with database and how we work with Tkinter. Now it's time to build our bookstore application. Let me show you how it will look. If I run this file and if I click on view all, you will get the all file. And if I type here the, the following description and add new, it will add a new file here. And if I want to update, I can click on update if I want to delete I can delete it I can search also and I can close also so to develop this program you need a prior knowledge of MySQL how you can work with MySQL uh, if you don't know how you can work I will first recommend you to watch that tutorial and if you want me to build that tutorial for you tell me in the comment box I will do that also so let's jump off to the building of this website not a website it's an application <laughs> okay guys let me just create a new file for this project let's say mm -hmm. store book store okay store.py and uh, we have to create basically a two files one which will work on a front end basically it will create the let's say uh, it is just like a body for our program let me show you this is the body it is a front end and the things we are which we are writing here and getting the output is the back end first we will work on the front end for that let's import from import all after that let's create a body let's say window equals to tk and uh, window dot main loop let's check it out python store dot py okay so the basic thing has been developed for our application now it's time to create some labels list one equals to label window comma the text what you want to labels are basically the text which we want to show here let me just show you what i am talking about let's say first we take the title let's say title after that uh, i have to put here a space for that read then row equals to zero column equals to zero save it let's set that out okay the label has been created let's create uh, some more labels let me just copy it Level number two. Let me first copy all. Okay. Level number two. Level number two. Level number three. Level number three. And level number four. And let me just change the name. Level number two should be a U T author name. Then the book in which the year in which the book is published and the ISBN code and I have to specify the space for them in line 0 let's say I want in column 2 uh, I want in line 1 column 0 line 1 column 2 save it just run it let's see what we want Okay, 
so our phone label has been created okay it's time to get a entry in these labels let's say e1 equals to entry window comma text variable equals to I have to create a variable which I have to put the value let's say uh, 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 um, let's say et1 equals to string var it's a variable et1 then I have to put a space for here et e1 dot read row equals to zero call them equals to one let me copy it out and do the same for other three okay entry two entry two entry two Entry three, entry three, entry three, entry four, four, and four. Let me just change here also one, two, three, and four. And what else I need to change? Yes, the column three. One, 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 and three. Let's see what we got. Oops, Python four dot py. Yes, our four column has been created. So, what's the next step now? Let's create a list box where the all the values of the user will enter. Uh, let's say lst equals to list box window height equals to um, let's say 35 with equals to let's say 50 and then and the rest dot breed row equals to 2 column equals to 0 save it run it okay what happened let me see okay guys there is nothing wrong what i have done is that this list box command i have put it after this window main loop i have created this list box command uh, out of our window that's why i got an error and if i try it in this window dot main loop and uh, print this statement you will get a box like this where you will get the output all outputs now what's the next step let's create a scroll bar now srl equals to scroll bar now here where you want to create this scroll bar we want to put it in windows after that give it the greets uh, row equals to one column equals to let's say one mm -hmm. what's next step yes row span equals to six okay okay guys let's print this out Okay, so our scroll bar has been created so in the next video i will show some more things so stay tuned thank you